So Spencer, tell me about the tea that we're reviewing today. Well, today we're going to be reviewing a black tea from, what'd you say you got this? Paris? That is called the Marriage Teas. Now, whether it's actually about marriage or divorce, you have yet to see. This is a French tea. Um, full disclosure, we have had this tea before, but unfortunately our sound was really, 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 really bad. And you couldn't hear a darn thing we were saying. So we are going to redo this tea so that we can give you our honest opinion. Smells like a good black tea. Yes, it does. <laughs> So this is the Marriage Ferrer tea. This is the English breakfast tea. Thank you. We will do a scoop for me, a scoop for you, and a scoop for the pot. Which one? I couldn't remember what lid. I love these handy little tins that they come in. We are using our small teacups. Excellent. Hey Siri, set a timer for three minutes. So in case you didn't know, my name is Linda Arnold and I am the owner artist here at Whimsy Kettle Custom Painted Teapots. I am on a quest to either find or make the perfect teapot and then fill it with the perfect tea. Joining me on my quest, as usual, is Spencer. Mm. How are you, Spence? Pretty good. Excellent. Okay, so it says French tea, noble teas, and distinctive house blends. Around 1660, on behalf of King Louis the 14th and the French East India Company, the ancestors of the Marriage Brothers sailed to distant lands on a quest for new exotic flavors. Tea soon became a strong family passion maintained over the centuries in a tradition of excellence in taste and creativity, giving birth to the French art of tea. Welcome to the sophisticated world of French teas. Ooh. So I am excited. Hey Siri, stop timer. Okay. So we'll give it a little swirly dirly. The leaves have plumped up nicely. They are a bit more ground. Uh, they're not full leaves. Okay, so looking at it, it has a beautiful color. It is that gorgeous red color uh, with the, a little bit of the golden notes around the white areas. Um, Ooh, smells like a black tea. Smells like a yummy black tea. And one second, I'm going to flip over a sand timer here, so it'll be about 3.15, 3.30. Yum. Wow, that is tasty. Um, that is brisk. And that's the word full-bodied comes to mind. I don't, it's, it's quite delightful. Um, it has just a touch of the bitterness to it. Um, it's really good. I'd almost say with the maltiness that's on the back end of it, mm. it may have some Assam in it. It that that is delightful. I am. After all of that, I'm gonna make it the Linda way. The Linda way. The Linda way. The Linda way. And it's cooled down a little bit, so it's even easier to drink. Oh, that is a, it's I, too much sugar for that, but it is delightful. Oh my gosh, it's delightful. When I say I need a good cup of tea, this is what I mean. This is a good cup of tea. All right, so I'm going to give it a thumbs up. And a cup. 
Ooh, sorry. All right. Because it's it's that good. Uh, do you remember the price of it? It, it was probably uh, twenty five or thirty dollars for the ten. It's like I said, it's a little mm. pricey. Well, our second brew three minutes is up, so if we want to get a um, second cup and try that out, I am going to give it a thumbs up, and I'm going to rate it a pot because mm. I could absolutely drink a pot of this without any problem at all. However, stating that. It will not go into the rotation outside. It mm. will go into the house rotation Ooh. because then I can share this with the hubby. Very good. Definitely going in the good box. Why don't you start calling him that? The hubby? Yeah. You know, it's, it's a pet name. All right. I am topping off. And I have finished my cup. <laughs> and split over for another. Spencer never drinks two cups of regular tea. Mm. Well, I haven't been drinking a lot today. All right. I'd almost be willing to see if we could get a third, but I'm not going to. Well, if we can get two, we can definitely get three. It'd be quite weak though, probably. Oh, that was hot. That was hot, that was hot. Yeah, that was okay, bad. so topping it off with the sugar and the cream, this... That was really hot. This is really delightful. You know, it's a dreary day outside, in case you can't tell behind us. I could take a pot of this tea into the house, curl up on the sofa, watch a Cary Grant movie, and just drink this tea, and I would be happy. Oh, that is yummy. Okay, so the second steeping is just about as good as the first. Absolutely. So we're not going to make you sit around and watch us drink this tea, but just, you know, Ow. I'm going to drink all of mine. Mm. Any last thoughts for you? you know, apparently Tenet's supposed to be set in the same universe as Inception. So thanks for coming by and having a couple with us today. We appreciate your time. We hope your day is much nicer than ours is, but we look forward to seeing you soon. Thanks. Did you enjoy our content today? We certainly hope so. If you did, make sure you give us a big thumbs up and make sure that you uh, hit that subscribe button and the bell notification so that anytime we upload new videos, which is usually on Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays, you can get a notification of it. If you didn't like what we're doing here, make sure you press the thumbs down button at least twice and go ahead and leave us nasty comments below because we're never going to read them. Thanks for coming by. We'll check you later.